Hey friends, uh, this is Mr. Kili talking to you about something so important to you guys and to me. This is the story of Akili Foundation. We established as a family 10 years ago with the main purpose of helping those whom society sometimes neglects. These are the people who fall into social challenges like alcoholism, drug addiction, and lack of practical skills of survival. So we at Akili Foundation saw the need to begin this program. And uh, it has been a successful journey nurturing these young people whom society has neglected. These are ladies who have fallen into challenges when they get into unwanted marriages or have children while they are in school and then drop out. For the young men with peer pressure, they get into drug addiction and alcoholism and eventually are not able to bend for themselves. So this is the group we've chosen to work with. And at our center, we provide them with basic skills like dressmaking, and carpentry, even running a salon, uh, farming, including dairy and chicken farming. We train them on food husbandry. We also show them practically how to carry out some of these activities. And after the period of training in the vocational center, we are able to send them back to continue running this, the businesses. And as a result of this journey, Akili Foundation has been able to rehabilitate more than 200 persons successfully over the years and also had students pass through the vocational center and successfully establish their own businesses. We would love to see the institution grow from strength to strength to be able to take on more students, more clients, and indeed have practical lessons and more support from well-wishers. We call upon you, our friends, to hold our hand by donating any amount of funds or equipment or any moral support and practical support you can put across for us to be able to build this center. Thank you and may God bless you. As the chairman has said, we are here to appeal for assistance from friends because uh, some of the people who get admitted are needy they don't have anyone to pay for them. So we are appealing that you come to pay our aid so that we can too be assisted.